Uh, YouTube. I am FF7 Soldier 7, and I and this will be a tutorial how to make the Simu emulator, the Wii U emulator, faster. It's a bit a tricky thing to do because uh, if your system is not, yeah, if your system is low end or very low end, uh, maybe this will crash your PC. So use it at your own risk. Uh, but first you need to download Cheat Engine, uh, the links will be in the, in the description, and uh, yeah, and the Wii U emulator will also be in the description. Well, first we, uh, I will um, open it, and just open the emulator, nothing fancy. aim later oh yeah if you need to make it uh, working uh, uh, because it can give the error if you open uh, a Wii U game uh, you need to type down a key in a text file um, this one is uh, the Wii U common key just type uh, I just put that in the description as well and the Mario Kart key so you can run it well, after you've done that, then uh, we uh, load the game. And that's the FPS counter. Oh, I need to use control for this. Um, yeah, okay, that's not real time because. Uh, well, if you restart the game, it will be 6, 7 FPS. My, uh, Rick. You see, it's hovering, uh, hovering in the twenties and thirties uh, in menu. And uh, now we will open Cheat Engine, and uh, we look for uh, the program. If it doesn't freeze, yes. And then uh, for CMU, which is running now. We open it, we enable speed hack, we lower it to open tree and apply. And you will hear the sound will be messed up. So, but look at the FPS. Oops, the FPS increased by uh, 50%. It's a lot smoother now. We just use time drills. This Mario. It is sl uh, a bit slow than the FPS counters say it is, so I don't know what to do about that. But hey, it, it's faster than normally. Uh, But you just saw there is an FPS increase. Well, the cheat engine does push the uh, emulator. Um, it just uses some sort of frame script, uh, frame skip, or um, a sped up uh, glitch, and. Uh, yeah, thanks to that, the performance is better, but the sound will be sacrificed. And the progress. It can be a bit slow while loading. 
and with uh, two recording programs and I use fraps for the FPS counter oh it's freezing again Well, I hope it will uh, boot up soon. Well, it's uh, a bit fluid. Let's see, it now it runs decently. Still, it's not on full speed. In the video I uploaded before, it uh, somehow it was full speed, but only in the video recording, not in the real gameplay. That's because uh, Bandicam thinks it was faster, because it says 60 FPS, 80 FPS most of the time. While, uh, well, it was in real time, it was speed like this and now an example without the speed hack uh, just pause the game I will disable the speed hack and you see see what happened it is slower now it is 14 fps pause it enable the speed hack apply it zoom and it's a bit faster I huh. no with the um, the cheat engine it will uh, force the game to run three times its normal speed. But even then it's pretty slow. To be honest. It's only a bit more uh, it runs a bit more smooth, but uh, yeah that's really it. Even though it's funny, the emulator is just out and we are actually able to play a game. It's quite crazy. Because uh, the 3DS emulator is actually slower than this. And I've tried. I even tried to make it run faster, but... Uh, well, not as that good of a grammar. Uh, or developer, so uh, yeah. Well, here uh, it just uh, keeps at uh, 40 FPS. Maybe uh, the performance will be better when I upgrade my wall rig to a, a Core i5 6600K. And then I can overclock and maybe it will run faster. We will see in the future. Oh yeah. I'm pretty bad in this game so... Uh, yeah.